Hello, welcome to this church service for Sunday the 17th of May 2020. It's the sixth Sunday of Easter. It's the Sunday before Ascension. Uh, last week, uh, the strain was telling me on me a bit and somebody questioned me about what the giraffe bit was all about. Well, I don't know what that was about, uh, but I suppose it was just something that happened to be lying around. Isn't that right, don't you think? Anyway, uh, we hope we've got suitable action-packed service for you today. And at the end of the service, since the three days before Ascension Day are traditionally known as Rogation Days, uh, when people beat the bounds of their parish, I'd just like to introduce you to the start of doing a boundary walk around the parish of Eccleshill. And since uh, lockdown has not exactly come to an end, but the regulations have been relaxed, it's possible for people to go walking in pairs, provided they keep a distance of two metres be between themselves. So you might like to pair up with somebody else and do some of the Ecclesill boundary walk during the rogation days of Monday, Tuesday and Wednesday. On Ascension Day, we'll be doing a proper service, but uh, here's one for today. Uh, let's begin uh, with a traditional Easter hymn, Jesus lives, thy terrors now can no more, O death, appall us. Uh, I'm very grateful to the choir of St Luke's Ecclesill uh, for singing along uh, and being virtually all together. Grace, mercy and peace from God our Father and the Lord Jesus Christ be with you. We are an Easter people and Alleluia is our song. Come Lord Jesus, let your life and power rule in our hearts. We rid ourselves of the old nature and we put on Christ our life. Praise be to the God and Father of our Lord Jesus Christ. In his great mercy he has given us new birth into a living hope through the resurrection of our Lord Jesus Christ from the dead. Here are some prayers of confession. 
Jesus, risen Master and triumphant Lord, we come to you in sorrow for our sins. We confess our weakness and unbelief. We have lived by our own strength, not by the power of your new life. In your mercy, forgive us. Lord, hear us and help us. We have lived by the light of our own eyes, not by trust in your help. Lord, in your mercy, forgive us. Lord, hear us and help us. We have lived for this world alone and doubted our home in heaven. In your mercy, forgive us. Lord, hear us and help us. Lift our minds above earthly things and set them on things above. Show us your glory and your power that we may serve you gladly all our days. Amen. May Almighty God, who brought his Son Jesus back from the dead, especially to show his victory over sin, give us forgiveness of our sins and assurance of his forgiveness in our hearts that we may live to the full capacity of life which is set before us. Through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Now we'll be hearing our Bible reading uh, from Donald uh, in a little bit at the start of the second of these videos. Uh, but here uh, are some songs based on part of the reading. So I better just summarise it for you quickly, hadn't I? Uh, Peter says, don't be afraid of the things that other people are afraid of. Try and do good. And if people quiz you, have something to say. Be prepared to give an answer to everyone who asks you the reasons for the hope that you have among you. Uh, because Christ died for sins once for all, uh, to the righteous for the unrighteous, to bring you to God. It's because he died for sins once for all, the righteous for the unrighteous, that of course we can proclaim the forgiveness of sins and we can come before him with thankful hearts. Let's do that in song. Three songs inspired by the Bible reading that we have today. Uh, the first uh, is, of course, about the resurrection of our Lord Jesus, which gives us the confidence for all these things. Jesus Christ is alive today, I know. Jesus Christ is alive today, I know, I know it's true. Sovereign of the universe, I give him homage to. Seated there at God's right hand, I am with him in the promised land. Jesus lives and reigns in me, that's how I know it's true. Jesus Christ is alive today, I know, I know it's true. Sovereign of the universe, I give him homage to you. Seated there at God's right hand, I am with him in the promised land. Jesus lives and reigns in me, that's how I know it's true. And so, says Peter, do not fear what other people fear. Don't be frightened. Set apart Christ as Lord in your heart. Uh, God says to his people, I have redeemed you. Do not be afraid. Do not be afraid, for I have redeemed you. I have called you by your name. When you walk through the waters, I'll be with you. You will never sink beneath the waves. Do not be afraid, for I have redeemed you. I have called you by your name. You are mine. When the fear of Loneliness is looming, then remember I am at your side. Do not be afraid, for I have redeemed you. I have called you by your name. You are mine. You are mine, oh my 
my child, I am your father, and I love you with a perfect love. Do not be afraid, for I have redeemed you. I have called you by your name. You are mine. Uh, Jesus got his name, of course. It means saviour. Uh, it was the same name as the name Joshua in the Old Testament. And when Joshua uh, was leading the people after Moses had died, the Lord said to him, Be strong and full of courage. Uh, for the Lord your God is with you. Be bold, be strong. Be bold, be strong, for the Lord your God is with you. Be bold, be strong, for the Lord your God is with you. I am not afraid, I am not dismayed, for I'm walking in faith and victory, come on and walk in faith and victory, for the Lord your God is with you. Be bold, be strong, for the Lord your God is with you. Be bold, be strong, for the Lord your God is with you. I am God. No, no, no. Walking in faith and victory, come on and walk in faith and victory, for the Lord your God is with you. So that's the end of these first of these three videos for our worship. Uh, and if you get to the end and just click on the link, uh, then you should find the second video. Or of, if you're on the YouTube channel, it should follow on automatically to the second video. You never can tell with this technology, but I'll see you in the next video.